oil change in a plastic fucking tank. <laughs> Who'd you learn that from again? What's that? Who'd you learn this learn this little? I'm about to do that then. Oh, fast like Nick? Yep. Oh, you gotta break that off. Ooh. You got to give it some muscle. You got a longer ratchet? I just got to get it from a different angle. You got a longer ratchet? Nah, it's the only one. kidnapped you today. Let's see. Make sure, make sure y'all go get his man to follow on YouTube, por favor. That's a creative tattoos, y'all. Come on, man. Ow. You want me to try to break it loose? Can you? Yeah, I'll give it a try. Torqued it. Yeah, that's a no-no. And it's look just like mine. Yeah. And it's like of all things you over tour. That pole. Yeah, we're supposed to do an oil change, but yeah. Somebody over torqued the drain plug and unfortunately. The boat got the head. The head of the boat got stripped. So yeah, I know a lot of y'all remember this car. I had a car just like this, but with Hellcat wheels. Yep. Did you have the replica? Yeah. And at least he got meat in the front tires. I didn't even have meat. I had the offset. But yeah, this was mine once upon a time. <laughs> I'm back. All right, y'all, I'm back, man. It was not a success. Whoever the hell did the oil change on that car before he took possession of the vehicle, they done over torque the oil drain plug. That's some shit you don't do. That's just some shit you just don't do. Whoever the hell did the oil change on that vehicle before he took possession of it, I 
probably personally go to them wherever the hell wherever the hell they reside at smack the living dog crap out of them because you don't do shit like that come on man when you do an oil change on the vehicle you guys uh you, all you gotta do is snug it that's it you don't need to torque it down come on all you gotta do is snug it as long as you got a good rubber seal and uh and a good uh, oil drain plug it ain't gonna leak i think every hundred some odd thousand miles you change your oil drain plug um other than that you really do, you really don't got to do nothing special to it so yeah y'all stay tuned right now i'm about to whip the dog crap out of this 300 right now y'all i do miss my car and as y'all know my next goal is to do a 300 full hellcat swap yeah i'm going all the way out with this one so y'all stay tuned right now i do not want to show where they live at i'm keeping that private and confidential so y'all stay tuned right now y'all y'all enjoy the rest of this video let's go uh, this looks way familiar except for the little screen <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, if you would have got at me when I was getting rid of mines, we could have we could have swapped that out. I could have put that in mines, and I would have gave you the big one. Oh yeah, but I didn't even wasn't even thinking. Yeah, about you that. probably wasn't even thinking about it at that time. And then you say, "Bro, you just got this." Yeah, I only had this like maybe five months max. Five months ago, that's. October, November. Awesome. Yeah, see, I got rid of it in September. At the light, you can make a right. At the light. Okay. Yeah, the big screen's plug and play. Yeah, same interior, just I think I had leather seats. Yeah, I think all the 2014s came with like all leather. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah. cousin had one he had an all he had a red one with uh 22s on it see that's that was the color that i wanted i wanted the burgundy one. and it was 2013 he had one with the not this transmission but the other one the uh the oh, the HP. HP, yeah. i ain't gonna say where we at but yeah ain't, ain't long beach uh, oh, oh well, yeah there y'all go yeah, we in Anaheim. Way smoother than mine. That's crazy. Way smoother. Yeah, this is way smoother. I don't know if they modified this. I don't know. It's stock suspension, and everything? No, it's all. It's not. It's not stock. Uh, oh. Cause um, so when they did the uh, the spring redid my uh, front end, my wings <coughs> and all that. Yeah. Uh, my control arm was broke. Um, so they replaced all of that. Like I don't, but I don't think it's stock suspension. Yeah, because it feels different than mine. Mine, I didn't like the suspension. I felt that left uh, or right. Left. Oh, it's right here. Left. You put it right there, so I didn't have to. Oh, so okay. it looked like you knew where you were going. No, oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is way smoother. Yeah, mine was did not ride like this. My ride quality was trash compared to this. The reason why I like it out here though is one is is because it's hella quiet. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, there you go. One is hella quiet. Too quiet. And I'm not used to it. <laughs> and like people leave you alone out here. Yeah. Like and you wouldn't think you wouldn't think they'll leave you alone from it being Anaheim and like all of the rich because we're in Anaheim. Well, almost on our way to Anaheim Hills. Um. So this is what like industrial part of Anaheim. Yeah, it's the warehouses and all that. Yeah. So over here, they really, like police don't really give a damn as long as you're not really messing with uh, with businesses. Fifty-seven North Phoenix Club Drive. Yep, I've been over here. Yeah, they got the golf golf course, course right, right here. here. Yep, I've been over here. So this Dodge right here does have like two Hellcats. There's one right there. Yeah. And uh black looks like a RT. Nah, that's a Y body something. And then out here, bro, like you know, they can put them on uh on front street and not worry about it getting getting to getting I know, I'm surprised I see that <laughs> Y body out there, yeah. That's crazy. 
You like your interior lights bright? Oh, do what you do. Oh shit! All right. Oh no, you can turn the light off. Oh. I just turned. Yeah, this yeah, this I just is your reminis- car until we get. Yeah, back I was where just, we going? I was just reminiscing with this. That's all it is. Yeah, this shit's too damn smooth. Yeah, you don't even feel nothing. What the? Yeah, I'm telling you, my wire quality on my was trash. I couldn't even take it on the freeway without it. Start doing. Yeah. Honestly, I think all I would need to do is just probably upgrade that throttle, the throttle body. Yeah. And probably a cold air intake. And, like, everything would be cool. Like, as is, with no no, no issues. Like, I have no issues now, but, like, as, as just an everyday car. Yeah. Suspension, they did a good job because this is too damn smooth <laughs> for real. And then I think maybe because you got the meaty tires in the front, I didn't have that. Oh, you had low pros, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I felt the wheel shop. I don't even want to say the name of it because we they tried suing me and everything, but uh, yeah, I think they fu- they screwed me over with the low pros in the front and then thick in the back, yeah, because I went through like four rim sets. Oh, cracking them, cracking them every time. Yep, cracking them every time. Yeah, never again. If I do get another one, I know, I know, I could put meaty tires all the way around. Yeah, because these are uh, 265. So in the front, it's 265, uh, 35RZ22. Yeah. Uh, 102L, I believe. And then the back is the same, but same the 102W. Yeah. It's just like brand new. You don't even feel nothing. Nah, no shaking, nothing. It's clean, real clean. Yeah, before I got rid of mine, mine was at 80, 90,000 miles. 
Oh, but yours started really messing up after the, the accident, huh? No, no accident. After they fixed it, they did a fuel pump, motor mounts, and they did one more thing. Oh, they fixed the AC because it wasn't blowing at all. They had to put a new, um, what's the name of that damn shit? Uh, no, not condenser. Um, blend door actuator where it switches from oh, hot, hot to cold. To cold. Yeah. There's two of them in here. If you got dual zone uh, climate. We do. Yeah, there's two of them in here. If, yeah, if it ever stops just blowing air completely, that's your blend door actuator. And then after that, that's when it come to rattle. Yeah, it started doing some crazy shit. Ran over something? Uh, I think it just has a slow leak. Oh. Um, I gotta check the ram. Uh-oh. Here we go. Here all the action. Oh, yeah. I know what I'm doing. Yep. Caught a car accident on camera. Was uh Plus uh Oh that's Chapman and Bradford. Yeah, city of Placen. Placentia? Placent. Yeah, whatever. I used to call it Placenta. Yeah. Everybody know what a placenta is. Yep. If you got kids. <laughs> hey, was it just wrecked? It's all different over here. I gotta get used to this quiet. It's still quiet. Two yeah, that, and you can hear, you you probably be able to hear those chains from like two blocks, blocks away. away. Yeah, it's too quiet. I gotta get used to this. Six months apart. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, right. We're, yeah, that's pretty goddamn good. And the crazy part is, I have brand new brakes in my uh, in the trunk. Yeah, just for the case when they go out. This, 
like street right here like they yeah. come all the way down so it goes to kramer right here so all the way from kramer you'll see cars just shooting fast and, co and cops don't give a damn like because coming around this corner like as long as it's a green light bro they like they don't really care but if you see it's a straight shot yeah the cops probably like that shit hell for all we yeah. know it's a, it's a straight shot so people will be lined up along this area right here yeah, this whole street yeah and then like we uh people do donuts here but mainly like not really this is mainly where we just do our racing oh okay because there's no potholes there's a little bit of bumps and shit but it's it's pretty much smooth out there. what time do you usually be out around here uh, around on this series, like on Saturdays, like yeah. they start coming out around like 11, 30, 12. All right, midnight? Yeah. Because then that's when they know all the, oh, cheap gas right here too. So if you ever need oh, gas. Oh, feels, yeah, we got that out here, out um, there. I think it's like 325 a gallon. Shit, it's cheap. This is like our uh, our playground right here. Oh, okay. Oh, it's like that's the Amazon warehouse. That's crazy. I got the Amazon right here. Yeah, I got everything around here. Yeah, we're gonna be opening up a fresh uh, Amazon by, Fresh. Yeah, down by Sam's Club, which is just easy. You just take the street all the way down and it leads you right into it. Yeah, I thought about getting that contract with the uh, Amazon Fresh. As a carrier? Yeah. That's easy, delivering groceries. Yeah. yeah it would be better, like, for your car, for the Nissan? Yeah. For that. Yeah, I thought about doing that shit, but it's full. Every time I check, it's still full. Everybody's on it. Yeah. Sheesh. We did 